Well, time for another dash cam video, and this time around, it's to do with this cyclist that I'm about to overtake. And I'm hoping this video is a perfect example of how one selfish cyclist destroys it for the majority of cyclists on the road. And in the end, I come up to a set of traffic lights where I've got to stop, because the law tells me that when there's a red light, I need to stop my vehicle. As far as I was taught, the road rules apply to all people on the road. But I'm sure there are many motorists who know there are some people who, well, basically make up their own rules and ignore the road rules. I know that whenever you talk about cyclists on roads, it's going to start arguments of people saying, well, they, you know, do this because of this, or they don't do this because of this. But the way I see it is, if you're on a bicycle and you're on the road, well, you're already taking a huge risk. Why would you want to add to that risk anymore? Anyway, it's to the cyclist's advantage to break the law because there's no identification on their bikes. If I told the police, hey, I saw this guy running a red light, and they said, well, what do he look like? I said, well, it was a man on a bike with two wheels. Oh, we get thousands of reports of this going on. At any moment, the friend I passed just earlier is going to run this red light. It wasn't as if the red light was about to change. It stayed red for a fair bit time more. So what was this guy thinking that he could just basically run the red light when I had to sit there and obey the law? I think this is the core reason why motorists get so annoyed with cyclists. But hey, on the other side, a whole group of cyclists are doing the right thing and they stop at a red light. So why is it when they're in a group, they obey the law, but when they're by themselves, well, they're free birds. They think they can do things completely outside the law. I'm very sure there'll be plenty of cyclists who are going to come in and defend the cyclist saying, well, he's doing this because, well, he made a safe choice. But hey, that's not the law. I could have gone through as well. If I was spotted and seen, hey, I would have had the police get me really fast. Anyway, I know the audience will know far more than me. As always, thanks for watching and bye for now. And cyclist, please obey the law. It's not a good look when you're running the red lights.